the O2s playing in their final game. And there's a lot of them for both programs. We're underway. Granite City in red, Alexandria in white. Frazier Cup National Championship right here on Hockey TV. Mark Robinson, big hits. Rebound out in front, right side. Robinson with a drive, that one just goes high. Rebound, far side again. Centering pass, what a stop. The net comes low. Pandemonium in front. Huge chances for Granite City, but Couch is in the way. Wow. Rob Robinson just missing the net, but then that second opportunity, Kausch was laid out and somehow stayed out of the net. And he walks away just unscathed as he goes to the corner. Cool, calm, and collective for Kausch. The first one there, line change for the Blizzard. Looking for some spacing. They're going to get it. Top of the circle. Top jump. They score. Bouncing puck. And the Blizzard strike first again. Oh, Flynn. Great pass back to the point by DeBrito. O'Flynn was just coming on the ice and throw it to the net. Got a little puck luck with that tip. Deflection. 100%, you gotta shoot those pucks and they shoot it from everywhere. Granite City didn't have anybody back for the line change. They had that from when you just start putting skates on. Here's another chance, far side. Top of the circle, they score! McIntyre, top shelf! And the Blizzard have started a fire. That line comes through again. McIntyre takes a beautiful pass from Kingery and just beat him high glove side with that wrist shot. Ryan lahette has been exposed here to that top shelf. Never had a chance to compose himself as Granite City. Deja vu to the Fraser Cup championships from last year where Rochester just started pounding him. Look out as he nearly got trucked over. At the center ice area, Sendin, he brings it in. Sendin, look at this entry. Sendin tries, he scores! Top shelf again! Sendin shoots a rocket, and it's 3-0. They gave him a little room there across the blue line. Didn't get a stick on that, and uh, they beat him on the stick. They beat LeHead on the stick side this time. It's quite obvious what needs to happen here, and it's not happening. Nobody's bodying up the blizzard, and they're going to take that drive all day long. Three goals in four minutes. The Blizzard, heavy. They bring everybody out. Delzer, he's bodied, still with control of the puck. Walks over the front of the net, right side. Puck is loose, defensive help, right side. They score! There we go! Granite City finds a way! Johnson in front. Kausch got tripped up. And a rebound popped out of nowhere. And they sent one five hole. And the yeah, drought mate. is over as Granite City finds the way. Excellent effort on the first shot there though, Mark, as we'll see here. Yeah, Kausch made the initial kick save, but the rebound went straight up the slot. It was the third shot that got him, and he looks back, rightfully so. Charlie Larson, left face off, Dada shot a bad save there by Lahet, but they couldn't clear it. Hedlund with a one-timer rebound, they score! Matt McIntyre buries the rebound in the blizzard do capitalize and take a 4-1 lead. Yeah, massive rebound and then one chance Granite City had their mark, they failed to clear it. Just couldn't get enough stick on that rubber. Got kind of fell down in that transition. It led to another scoring opportunity. Just good puck moving, get it on net, hope for a rebound. And an out of position, Lahat just gave way. Yeah, Stein, not much. Robinson and Kennett for Granite City as that shot in on net. Kausch gave up a rebound, they score! Tucker Skyme gets the goal for the Lumberjacks, and they have cut the lead in half. Pure hustle there. That, I can't wait to see again. I can't describe how that puck made it from where it did and through the bodies that it did, and it just kisses the inside post. Well, it was the rebound he gave up. That was the problem on that. And I just didn't make the right play on it. Yeah, he put his panel on over the blocker. And Sky makes some pay. Right there. Whitmore keeps it in, hands it off to Gronholz. DeMars with the shot, he scores! Hayden DeMars! A wrist shot off of Lahette. And the Blizzard go up 5-2 late here in the second. What did I just say? Got to block shots to save opportunities. Ryan Lahette, phenomenal second period. No help there in front. Schemenauer was just out of position. As that one buckled off his shoulder. Can't block shots from that far out. That's what's going to happen. Look at that space. 
Yeah, looked like he might have been screened by his defenseman at the last second. A head blizzard as Mortensen has it center point. Shot blocked there by Lukasik. He goes down, picked up by Delzer. Delzer hands it off to Bielenberg. Howard, they score! You called it, Lincoln Bielenberg Howard buries a power play goal at the 1931 mark, and it is 5-3. Granite City needed that big time. He put that bet back on the team. He's been here before. He scored big goals, but Granite City's got to put a couple together here. They can't be scoring one and then giving up two. They got to cut this deficit in half. They got some work to do, but hey, going into the locker room now down by two rather than three, that's, that's a big momentum boost. And that puts you right back in it. Right off the faceoff shot. That was blocked by Wyatt Johnson. Schemenauer from the right point. Tipped in front, they score! Granite City comes through and pulls within a goal. That shot from the point came from uh, Schemenauer. Brower tipped it on its way in and got through the pads. And it is 5-4. Got to get shots on net. Keep providing those big opportunities. And I, I told you, you sensed it. You can kind of tell that there was a motion in that ocean there. Granite City knew they had to dig down deep. They finally get that lucky bouncing puck. Well, yeah, just coming in right off the blue line, right through traffic, and it bounced off the leg. Of Johnson. Yeah. Hit off the end wall. There's Sam Brennan from the point. Brennan with the shot. Blocker save. Loose in the slot. That's kept in by Robinson. A turnaround shot. He scores! The Lumberjacks tie it up with 2.47 to go. Unbelievable. You just gotta believe, Mark. That is exactly what this league deserves is this type of game. Wow. This, this league worked so hard to get itself on the map from where it was 10 years ago to today. And this is what you get. Is that Zach Kennett getting a piece of that? Lumberjacks can't quite clear. Ekblad feeds it into the slot. Glove down by Knight. Knight in front. Oh, lost it. Now a shot. And Kasson wow. makes the save. Whoa. You find your heart? Is yeah. it in your stomach? Man, he had, had it and then just, like when he dropped it to the ice, it maybe took a funny hop on him. Yeah, 20 seconds left. Is there a superhero in the final 15 seconds? Pucks down low. Van Zylen back out in front. Bielenberg looking to make it two in a row. Right side. They score! Carson Van Zylen! Granite City completes the comeback. They lead. Six to five with 9.2 to go. Wow, speechless. You feel so bad for the Blizzard players that are down on the ice right now, but the elation on the other side, can't ask for anything more. If I'd you're fight. a hockey fan. They'll yeah. take the draw, they have it. Hadlin draws it back to Wyatt Johnson. They got to be quick here. Just Near side with three seconds left. Two seconds left. Granite City has climbed the mountain. A four-time NA3HL national champion and one of the most historic comebacks in Frazier Cup history. Six to five. Granite City backs against the wall in the universe. They come through. A four-time champion. Congratulations in introducing the 2023 Fraser Cup champions, the Granite City Lumberjacks.